What's up everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about how to fix a problem with the HD60S Elgato where it is saying no signal on your Xbox or your PC. I searched everywhere for this. I searched probably 25 different videos and nothing was able to give me the information I needed. I tried everything but none of those actually worked. So this is something that worked for me and hopefully it can help you guys out a little bit as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to settings. It's on my front page already but what I'm going to do is go up to the right to and then click on settings. On this we're going to go to the general and then we're going to go to TV and display options. For say this is on the Xbox Series S or X so this is what it is in 2023. This might be able to help you if you're trying to find a newer version of what's going on because the older versions, they didn't have any of this stuff. It was harder to find what I was looking for. But once you're here, you're going to go to the TV and display options. You click on that. From here, your resolution is the problem that I ran into. I thought I could run it at 1444K because that's what my TV is at. That's what all my stuff, streaming stuff is at. Unfortunately, for this old HD 60S, it only can run at 1080p. So if you're running into the problem that you have too high resolution on your TV, your only option here is to go and click on 1080p. You're going to have to submit that and say, yes, you want, it, you want it to stay at this resolution. And after that, it should, if it works for you, automatically pop up on your TV and then on your Elgato streaming software that you're usually, that you're, you're working with. So that is about everything that I know. Um, if you try there's a many other videos out there that you could try this one's the only one that worked this is the only thing that worked for me so i hope it all works for you guys and best of luck thank you